And exactly one year ago today, that state, our state line was hit by another round of severe storms when a derecho touched down in Rockford. Two tornadoes also struck Rockford on August 10, 2020, with the derecho reaching damaging winds nearly 100 miles per hour and sprawled for hundreds of miles all across the Midwest. Neighborhoods all over the city had downed trees, power lines, severe damage done to homes. The worst damage done in Forreston, where five people were injured and a disaster declaration was proclaimed. Two mobile home parks were nearly destroyed down there. Now, Justin, we aren't expecting this type of severe severity going into tonight, but I mean, last year we weren't expecting it in a blink of an eye. That happens. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, obviously, this is going to be something that will kind of evolve with time here, but we are not talking the same sort of setup as what we had last year. Regardless, we do have the potential for some severe weather. I mean, just take a look at the storm reports from last year during that August 10th, 2020 derecho. So the good news is we're not talking derecho tonight, but we are talking the potential for some very, very strong winds. In fact, up over potentially hurricane force. I've got the detailed timing on that, of course, coming up in my full forecast, but for now, at least I think we can all kind of breathe a sigh of relief here on the year anniversary that we are not necessarily looking at a callback to what we went through last year at this time. Yeah, but a good news there. Thanks for the update, Justin.